Recently I shot some videos of me playing games on a TRS-80 Model 4 and I had a couple of people ask if I would give a little tour of the machine since it's been upgraded significantly since I've got it. Uh, it's also been cleaned up significantly. Uh, it was in pretty poor shape as you'll see from the pictures that I'm going to insert in here. The uh, machine itself has been upgraded to 128K. It's had a GoTech put in place of drive zero. It has a free HD with the boot ROM, a high resolution graphics upgrade, and the new KE80 upgrade. Uh, with the new KE80, I've actually got it using one of the 2.4 gigahertz wireless keyboards that you can see there in front of the screen. Uh, if we zoom in here, we can just kind of start. Uh, I did have my brother Clay replace the filter cap on the power supply too as it blew itself out. Uh, there you can actually see the new key 80 and uh, there's the cards from some of the guys that have helped me get stuff to get this machine cleaned up. Uh, you can see its born date there is December of 1984. Um, Jay Newarth uh, helped me with getting me a new keyboard and with getting the 128K badge to put on the keyboard. Um... Greg McGill uh, helped me with getting a GoTech case that actually supports the larger display and also a five and a quarter inch drive bay filler. Uh, the drive one is actually the drive one that was in the machine. Jay also had to make me a custom cable because the uh, GoTech there has the three and a half inch style floppy connector, whereas the five and a quarter inch drive has the card connector. So I had him make me a cable up. As you can see it there. Uh, to get me set up there. Uh, got that Bluetooth speaker there plugged into the cassette port for sound. Uh, there you can see the high res upgrade board as well as the free HD boot ROM, and then that cable right here is coming down from the free HD boot ROM uh, to a little switch hanging down there. I haven't, oops, I shut him in the door, I uh, haven't really mounted that yet. That lets you flip back and forth in between booting from the free HD or booting from the floppy drive, or in this case, the GoTech. There's the high res controller board from Ian. Uh, this one, I don't know if the camera can zoom in or not. It's the graphics 5.1 V2 version. Uh, there's the serial number sticker. Uh, it has to connect over to this IC right here with just one little jumper wire, otherwise it plugs right into the board. Uh, also got the, whoop, got the RAM upgrade here to bring it up to 128K. Uh, that's really only usable, uh, for a few things and not really much of anything I use it for, but uh, Jay helped me with that as well as the the boot ROM there. So 
But otherwise, that's the machine. Uh, I've got an Atari joystick with hooked up. Actually, it's a gem stick that hooked up to an extension cable. And there you have it. Uh, my first TRS-80 Model 4.